Hi guys, it's Carol. How you doing? I'm doing really good. I'm almost through with this coughing thing I had going on. And I'm feeling pretty good. Uh, for my all my new subs, I wanted to tell you, I don't know what my channel is about because I just talk about what I want to. <laughs> you know, when I turn the camera on, I'm just talking about what I want to. And I learned that from Nona Grace. If you don't watch Nona Grace's channel, go watch her. It's Nona, N-O-N-N-A, Grace, G-R-A-C-E. I really like to watch her. And that's what she does. She just sits down and starts talking. Well, I watched, I was watching a YouTube thing just now, and I want to talk to you about it. Um, I... I don't have cable TV. I have an antenna that you stick on the wall. And because I'm in an apartment complex and there's too many brick walls between me and the wherever the tower is, I can't get all the channels, all the local channels. I can get PBS and I can get um, NBC and I can get CBS, but I can't get ABC. Which is kind of a bummer because there's, I think there's only one thing on ABC I would want to watch, but it would be Ellen. Ellen makes me happy. Ellen makes me laugh. Ellen makes me smile. I wish I could see Ellen. So every now and then, uh, I'm subscribed to her YouTube channel and something pops up. Well, uh, today, uh, the guest on her show was a man from Israel. And his name is Lior Souchard. L-I-O-R-S-U-C-H-A-R-D. I want you to write that down. Lior Souchard. Amazing. Uh, when America's Got Talent is on, I love the magicians the best. Uh, I just love magicians. Now, we all know magic is not real. It's a trick. It's a sleight of hand. It's it's a trick somehow. That's what all these magicians do are tricks. This man is a mentalist, which I'm sure is also a trick, but good golly, I don't know how he does it. I, I want you guys to watch this. I mean, it's like eight minutes long. Watch the YouTube video Today, today is February 3rd, 2020. If you put in this man's name, Lior Souchard, and Ellen, search for that, it's the first thing that pops up and to, if you do it today. <coughs> Sorry, I'm almost over this cough thing. Well, anyway, I was watching a, a YouTube thing of, of this, and... This man is amazing. He is amazing. I want you to watch Ellen today or watch this YouTube clip. Just search for Leo Souchard and Ellen. It'll pop up. And I want you to tell me how he does it. It just blows my mind. He, he just, he, you know, his thing is he reads minds. And... He does something, and I don't know how he does it, so I hope you'll explain it to me because it fascinates me. It just fascinates me. Um, so that's what I'm, what I'm thinking about right now. Um, I wish I could do a live, and I could throw that out there, and I would say, wait, a, I'm going to wait on you. You go watch that <laughs> clip, and then come back and talk to me about it. <laughs> Uh, it, it amazes me. But anyway, so that's what um, I've been doing is sitting here watching YouTube clips while my puppies sleep. It's nap time. <laughs> and uh, uh, it's kind of a beautiful day. I think it's supposed to get up to the 60s. But tomorrow, that Tuesday and Wednesday, our highs are supposed to be something like 30 and the wind chill in the, in the evening is going to be single digits. So it's going to be a totally different day. <laughs> uh, 
tomorrow. But anyway, I got out to go try to renew my driver's license. I guess because I'm over 65 now, I turn, just turned 66, I got a letter from the state saying I'm not eligible to renew my license online or through the mail. I have to go in. So uh, when my daughter came home for lunch between work and school, I was going to take the car and go get my license renewed. Went to where I thought it was, and they had moved, and it's not there anymore. It's clear on the other side of town. I live in a town of about 200,000 people, and it's all spread out because we got plenty of room here. It would probably take me 30 minutes to get there, and then I'd have to, you know, stand in line and get that done, and then 30 minutes to drive back. Well, I didn't have that much time because my daughter needed to get to school. So I just, I, the place where I thought it was, um, I turned around and came home. But anyway, on the way home, I went by one of our local convenience stores. I just drove by. Um, now, you know, I told you we have some quirky things here where I live. This is one of the quirky ones. You know, you probably have a Circle K convenience store or you may have a 7-Eleven convenience store, you know, where you buy gas and go in and get milk and the Coke or whatever. What we have here is called Toot and Totem. <laughs> toot and Totem. <laughs> and how that name came about is way back in the, I don't know, 50s, I think, a long time ago anyway this family started this business. It was a little convenience store, and the idea was you could drive up, toot your horn, somebody would come out and see what you want, they'd go, then they'd go get it and tote it out to your car. <laughs> that is not a lie, I did not make that up. <laughs> toot and tote them. <laughs> well, in my lifetime, <laughs> since I've been an adult, you never, you couldn't go up and toot your horn and somebody come out and see what you wanted. <laughs> that went away a long time ago, but they still have the name, Toot and Totem. If you're an adolescent male child, you call it Fart and Fetch em. <laughs> Oh my gosh. But anyway, when I drove by Toot and Totem on my way home a while ago, I saw that gas is, for unleaded, is $1.94. Uh, yesterday, I had gone to the grocery store and it was a dollar ninety-eight, so it's come down. I I can't even remember the last time we've had gas in the one nineties. I mean, it, sometimes we do, but typically no. So, of course, I wanted to stop and get gas, but my daughter had already filled the car up, so I couldn't do that. But anyway, that's what's going on where I live. Toot and totems got unleaded gas for a dollar ninety-four. <laughs> And I really want you to check out this man on Ellen, Lior Souchard, and then tell me how he does that. Uh, I don't know anything else today. <coughs> Sorry. I just uh, don't have anybody in my house to say, tell me how he did that. So I'm saying to you, please watch this little clip. Tell me how he does that. <laughs> All right, guys, don't know anything else. Oh, my cell phone's saying low battery, I gotta go. Bye. <laughs>